Hello, today I'm recording a quick video to let you know about some changes that will affect you when buying or owning a property that's buy to let. So today is the 1st of April and in comes the higher rates of stamp duty tax. So anybody buying an additional property from today will pay the new rates of stamp duty. So they're going to be 3%, 5% and 8% respectively. So if you're buying a property that's not going to be your one and only home to live in, you will need to pay the additional rate of stamp duty. Now there is a bright side to this, it is going to be reclaimable on the sale of the property. So it can be offset on the capital gains when you come to sell. So it's not all bad news. Now there's also some changes happening to mortgage interest relief. From 2017, mortgage interest will now be counted as a taxable income and you will only receive this relief if you're a basic rate taxpayer. This means that if you pay income tax at the basic rate of 20%, you shouldn't see any changes in the amount that you owe. However, landlords that are basic rate taxpayers may be affected as it could push you into the high rate tax bracket. Now, it's gradually being introduced over four years and is due to be fully enforced from the 2020-2021 tax year. Now, these rules may change and all depend on your own circumstances, but I thought it was worth a mention and I would always recommend that you take your own independent tax advice. I hope you found this video useful today, but if you've got any questions about buy to let, I'm happy for you to pick my brains, so pick up the phone and give me a call. I'm Catherine Bond from the Northwood Northampton office and you can reach me on 01604 60 70 80. Thanks very much.